hi guys and uh, welcome back to my youtube channel now in this video uh, i'm going to discuss about few uh, neurology courses okay so like uh, if you want to study about neurology then there are different courses available on the internet some are free and some are paid so i'm going to share with you few courses that you can do and they're really good courses uh, so um, you can do any one of them if, if you find something interesting then you can do okay and you don't need to be a medical student to do these if you are a biology student, then you can do them and if you're just interested in neuroscience okay uh, so then you can do them okay uh, there is no issue okay so all these courses are there on the on a uh, on my website bukeshi so the link is in the description description there you can uh, go through all these courses okay so the first course is from coursera and that is medical neuroscience okay now this is the only course in the whole series which is a bit related to medical and which requires something which is important for you only if you are in a medical school or if you want to if you're just first or second year of medical college or uh, you are in school and you just want to learn more about neuroscience okay like i when i first studied uh, neurology then i think i was in 12th standard first time when i like not in 12th actually i was in 11th standard so I studied them from anatomy lectures of Dr. Marion Diamond, okay? So they are not pure anatomy for medical college they, or medical school. They are actually uh, anatomy for uh, the uh, normal uh, students, okay? If, you, if some, somebody wants to study biology, so they were in a course integrated biology. And let me tell you, the neuroanatomy which I studied in that course is still now the best neuroanatomy I ever studied, okay? And this course is also great. You can do uh, Marion Diamond's uh, MAMS course or you can do the Leonard E. White. So this is from Duke University. The professor is uh, Leonard E. White. And this is a really long course. I think how much long? I, it's a 70 hours uh, long course, okay? So, and there are many, many uh, videos. So if I'm talking about the topics, then you will study about about the neuroanatomy of the human brain and the CNS, okay? Uh, then you will study about uh, neural signaling, okay? Neural signaling is really important. And then we will study about some central uh, system like the visual system, auditory system, okay? And then the motor control and how this all, this all works and any anything then you will study about some complex actions okay now why do you want to do this first of all if you just want to learn about brain and how does it, this work then it's important uh, if you are working in a field where you see a lot of uh, neurological things or if you work with patients who have neurological problems and it's not covered in your uh, usual courses or degrees then this course is a must for you because this will tell you a lot what is happening around you okay uh, if you are working with these patients or uh, in any ways okay and you don't need to pay for this course like if you want a certification and if you want to add that certificate in your uh, cv then this then you can pay for the course uh, otherwise you can do this you can just audit this course and learn stuff like like i how, how i did these all things i just learn these things okay if you want quizzes and if you want certification then then only you have to pay otherwise for the lectures it's free not an issue okay okay and you need a basic biology and chemistry for this course okay now the next course so this was the basic neurology course if you just want to understand neurology if you want to work with them okay now all the other courses which i'm going to tell you are going to be a little bit more um, advanced and more interesting okay so the first course the second course okay i'm telling you it's from john hopkins university and it's a really specialization so there are four courses under it and this is really really interesting and the name of the course is neuroscience and neuroimaging specialization so neuroimaging that means you will study about um, about what uh, you will study about um, MRIs in uh, neuroimaging okay but you will also study here about neurohacking so let me tell you what all we are going to see so it's again a long course uh, so not as long as in medical neuroscience but this will be still a longer course like 40 to 50 hours it will take uh, if you uh, do it continuously so it may take like uh, a month it will uh, take to uh, understand all okay so the first thing first course which you will study about is the imaging the principle so basic fundamental principle what is it and then you will understand about the functional uh, magnetic res uh, resonance imaging okay so fmri so you will study about like basic not the basic mri which you do fmri is a little bit more advanced so you will do that and you will see how psychologists and all and statistics how does it all work okay so and then you will study about something really interesting so basically what is uh, that uh, uh, when you talk about uh, brain and what we are now more linking it to things like uh, programming okay so uh, the language which we use here is R programming okay so uh, so uh, in that you will study about neuro hacking okay so uh, you will understand a lot of uh, things there and uh, uh, it's a bit complicated like even explaining you uh, here is going to be a little complicated so uh, and if for to understand this you need uh, uh, the basic r how it works and then you need to know what you are uh, looking for 
okay so it's a bit complicated uh, things but uh, if you do this then you will definitely fl flourish in your business because you know these things are going to enter our uh, uh, dominion very soon but they are they have entered uh, already but like if i am in medical uh, college and they are going to soon enter it on colleges also okay so very soon okay we'll see uh, then uh, there is another course now this is a, this is also a, a pretty um, not as long as these courses but smaller than them but still it is a uh, good course so uh, this is sleep neurobiology medicine and society so all about sleep so this is uh, if you're really uh, interested like some students uh, i've seen who really want to research about sleep so if you're like this these type of courses if you are like a medical students or your psychology students or your biology student and you want to do research on sleep because sleep is something uh, in which you do uh, research then you are definitely going to uh, get something there because there is a lot uh, undiscovered there and a lot, not a lot of people are working on it and you know we need people to work on it uh, on in, in india right now if somebody has some uh, very complicated sleep uh, problem then they have to go to the highest centers only uh, there are no good clinicians available who can just work on sleep so if you just want to work on sleep then uh, you can uh, uh, do this course so what this all has let me tell you so the first is the neurobiology which is the basic and then we have the neurobiology of sleep and wakefulness that's also very simple nothing um, more complicated then we have something a little bit more higher that is the mathematical modeling of uh, sleep wakeful uh, regulation okay so and then we have uh, the genetics and molecular biology of sleep okay so this is really complicated and after this you will understand something really more interesting subjects like overview of sleep medicine and then uh, how sleep disorders disordered sleep and how it is uh, affected with the cardiovascular health okay and other thing so about psychiatric disorders related to sleep then of course insomnia then you will study about treatment of insomnia okay and then how sleep is related to anesthesia then uh, about circadian circadian rhythm and all okay so these are mid standard tracks and then daytime sleep uh, sleep uh, sleepiness and sleep needs so this is a really intensive course on sleep sleep is a really really important part of neurology and if you know if you do discover something on sleep and you get a good patent or you you build up something machine then you are going to become a millionaire or a billionaire okay and you may get a nobel prize also this is so fascinating and so important research okay so if you are in the field of medical and if you want to do research on something and especially in psychiatry then sleep is one of the things of course in psychiatry most of the research is because it's so much growing that most of the research has have potential to make you millionaires some has been in it. like if you do something for hair fall or something hair fall is actually dermatology or if you do something for uh, sexual disorders then definitely you will become a billionaire these things won't make you a billionaire but they will make you like a hundred millionaire kind of thing okay these are that important uh, researches okay then we have the last course so this course is not on uh, these things this course is a, a different course it's from future learn now future learn courses are really simple but the topic which of this course this is from uh, uh, central queensland queensland university the sleep course was from university of michigan the uh, neuro hacking and all that course was uh, from neuroimaging that was from john hopkins okay and this one is for central queensland university australia okay and this is on future learn now in this course it's a it's a not just a course it's an expert track so there are four courses in that so let me tell you about those courses so the first will be the edu education to educational so i have not yet named the course yet so it's the educational neuroscience research led uh, teaching approaches okay so now look carefully so what this course is going to be about that when you this is basically going to be art of learning how neuroscience and learning and memory these all things work okay so there will be in your orientation to educational neuroscience and these are very small courses not a big uh, problem like 6 to 7 hours per course and it will be like 30 35 hours complete uh, expert track okay then you will understand about the uh, learning and memory and then you will study like when you when you are clear with these things then you will study some complicated things like neuroplastics okay so neuroplasticity and then neuromyths so what are these things and you will learn they are they may just sound complicated but when you will actually study them they are very simple not a big problem and then neuro leadership and conceptual approach so everything and basically you are studying about everything but just you are adding a neuro word in front of them okay so not a big problem and uh, you will learn about a lot of things and why is this course if what why what should what is the motivation to do this course is if you want to become an educator uh, like a, you want to become a wonderful educator and you want to build uh, those workshops for students and work in the field of that like if for a very very big institution then courses like these are going to help you a lot uh, you will um, 
Like you can your your courses, your workshops can um, achieve greater heights if you have done courses like these. Okay, and this is not a free course. The other courses, they were free. I guess John Hopkins ones was not free. For that you need to pay. Well, earlier it used to be free. Like you can just audit it without certificate. Uh, but now I guess it. I you check. Uh, they are change. They are keep on changing it. But this course is not free. You need to pay to do this course, and of course, this course has something. It's a future learn course. Uh, that's why it is going to be paid. So it's your wish if you want to do this course or these courses or not. The two courses are absolutely free without certificate. So you can try them, and if you love them, then do comment in this comment in the description. And if you find any other neurology courses, then do tell me in the descriptions, and I'll happy to review them. And um, so take care and God bless you and uh, learn neuroscience.